dioxide and oxygen. This is a compound of copper, which is a transition element acting as a catalyst here. That is why it is said they exhibit catalytic activity. They form colored ions. Most of the transition metals are colored in nature, except a case where their D orbital is fully filled or is vacant. Every other one has different color, just like copper. Copper has a blue color. Copper as one of the transition elements. It, it is one of the less reactive metals and belongs to a group of elements known as the transition metals. Examples, other examples are silver and gold. Extraction of copper. Copper is usually extracted from sulfide ores such as copper pyrites. The ore is concentrated by fruit flotation and then roasted in air because of its reactivity nature. Test. It gives a blue precipitate with sodium hydroxide due to the formation of this compound. Copper 2 hydroxide is what is responsible for the blue coloration of its precipitates. To confirm whether it is copper that is present, we dissolve in excess of aqueous ammonia. The precipitate dissolves. That means it's insoluble in excess aqueous ammonia. And that is a confirmatory test. Use of copper. What are copper used for? It is widely used for making electric wire. Two, it is used in metal work. Three, it is used in roofing and plumbing. Four, it is used in the production of wide range of alloy, compounds of copper, copper one oxide. It is obtained as a red precipitate by reducing an alkaline solution of a copper to salt. Properties. It reacts with dilute tetrahydrosulfate 6 acid to give copper two sulfates. Give. So it, copper 2 ion reacts with dilute tetrahydrosulfate 6 acid to give copper 2 tetrahydrosulfate 6 salt. And that is one of the chemical properties. It reacts with concentrated hydrochloric acid to form a complex. Copper 2 oxide preparation. It is prepared by heating copper 2 carbonates, which is also known as copper 2 triazocarbonate 4 or copper 2 triazonitrate 5 by heating it. So this is copper 2 triazocarbonate 4. When it is heated, it gives copper 2 oxide plus CO2. And this is our compound of interest, copper 2 oxide. Also, when you have copper triazonitrate 5, it's also heated. When it is heated, it gives copper 2 plus nitrogen 4 and oxygen. So these are the two ways by which copper 2 oxide can be prepared. Properties of copper 2 oxide. One, it is a hygroscopic black solid. Two, it is insoluble in water. Three, it reacts with reducing agents such as hydrogen and carbon 2 oxide to give it corresponding metals. Yeah, it, this hydrogen has a reducing agent where it reduces this copper two oxide to copper and water. Then, in the case of carbon two oxide, it is being reduced to copper and carbon four oxide. 
four, it decomposes at a temperature above 1000 degrees Celsius to give copper one oxide and oxygen. Five, it reacts with tetrazobe six acid to give a blue compound of copper two tetrasulfate six. The reaction to justify that is at this copper two oxide formula of it at temperature greater than 1000 degrees Celsius. It, it decomposes to copper one oxide and oxygen. That is the byproduct in number four. Then number five. Copper 2 oxide react with tetrasulfate 6 acid in the dilute form to give copper sulfate plus water. So, these are the reactions to justify number 4 and number 5, where in number 4, at a temperature greater than 1000 degrees Celsius, it decomposes to copper 1 oxide and oxygen. Likewise, copper 2 oxide reacts with tetrazole 6 acid in the dilute form to give copper sulfate and water. It is used, uses of copper 2 oxide, it is used in organic analysis. 2. It is used as a catalyst in the thermal decomposition of potassium trazochlorate 5 salts. Potassium trazochlorate 5 salt thermal decomposition when it is applied, it gives potassium chloride and 3 moles of oxygen. This copper 2 oxide is used as a catalyst here because it does not take part in the reaction. What it does is to hasten the rate of reaction. Copper 2 hydrooxide preparation. It is prepared when an alkali is added to a copper two salt solution where it is precipitated. Properties It dissolves in excess aqueous ammonia to form a deep blue tetraamine copper two complex ion. This is copper two tetraamine complex two plus ion. So that's the compound that it gives when it, it is dissolved in excess ammonia. Uses it is used in dissolving cellulose, copper one chloride. Preparation it is prepared by passing sulfur four oxide through a solution of copper two sulfur tetrasulfate six and sodium chloride. Properties. It is a white covalent solid which is readily soluble or which is readily oxidized to give copper 2 chloride in moist air. Copper 2 tetrasulfate 6 preparation. It is prepared by action of dilute tetrasulfate 6 acid on copper 2 oxide or Trisocarbonate 4 or oxidation of copper tonnage with tetrasulfate 6 acid. Copper tonnage with tetrasulfate 6 acid, where copper sulfate plus 2 H plus. And this is a compound of interest that's copper 2 tetrasulfate 6. Properties. On crystallization, the salt is obtained as blue pentahydrate crystals, commonly known as blue vitrol. Is what you have on crystallization. They call it blue vitrol. Blue vitrol. Two, it loses four molecules of water at Temperature of 100 degree centigrade. So when this is passed to a temperature of 100 degree centigrade, it loses four 
molecules of water, thereby giving rise to this, where the four molecules of water will be lost. Uses. It is used mainly as fungicide for spraying vines, citrus, trees, and potatoes. It is also used in electroplating as a timber preservative in dyeing and in the preparation of other copper compounds. Copper 2 trioxonitrate 5 preparation. It is prepared by the action of copper on trioxonitrate 5 acid. When you have copper on trioxonitrate 5 acid, here you have copper 2 trioxonitrate 5. Where you have this, then hydrogen gas will be evolved. So this is how copper 2 trouser nitrate 5 salt is prepared. Properties on eating, it decomposes into copper 2 oxide, nitrogen 4 oxide, and oxygen. When copper 2 trioxonitrate nitrate 5 is heated, when it is heated, it decomposes to copper 2 oxide plus NO as NO2, which is nitrogen 4 oxide plus oxygen. Copper 2 trioxocarbonate 4. Preparation. It is precipitated when sodium trioxocarbonate 4 is added to any copper salt solution. Properties. It is a blue green insoluble solid which decomposes into copper 2 oxide and carbon 4 oxide on eating. It is also attacked by acid to liberate carbon 4 oxide. On eating of copper trioxocarbonate 4, when it is eaten,